how are you today? I am so excited because I have completed my very, very first storyline chapters book album. I um, used Storytellers version 3 from Heidi Swap to do this um, document our trip to Melbourne um, for Easter and I'm gonna just go through it right now um, so this is my cover page this is very very heavily influenced by Heidi Swap um, and I used uh, basically a lesson or a spread per day for our trip um, so only coming down to the end when I ran out or completed all the lessons um, did I begin creating some um, different things that went in a lesson but everything in the first part of the album is heavily inspired from the lessons in Storytellers version 3 from Heidi Swap. So I really enjoyed using my supplies. Um, I didn't have all the stamps that Heidi used at the time that I created this. Um, they actually just came over the weekend. Um, so those are some variations, but pretty much, um, these are some pretty cool interactive bits that were thought, taught, I really enjoyed making them and I enjoyed, um, putting this album together. This is my very first travel album and... Yeah, it was fun. I think I really enjoyed being able to do it right away as soon as we returned from the trip so that it didn't have time to get cold. <laughs> uh, so I like these flip-ups and being able to add in more pictures. I had a lot of pictures from this trip because it was um baby's first flight. And so... um you'd see that I really enjoyed all the techniques and tips that um, Heidi taught in her class. I really like this one with the double page album because it really is perfect for you know like events where you have lots of pictures um, for one day and you just want it to be you know in one space. And this I love creating. Um, and of course the journaling is and here, hidden journaling. And then picture before and after. And then here we have um, cousins meet up. He met his, a lot of his cousins for the first time. So um, because of COVID, we weren't able, and restrictions, we weren't able to see them before. Um, so it was nice being able to document and capture these things. I really liked this day because I had a lot of pictures as well. We went into the city. We went to our favorite um, restaurant that we would go to when we were courting or dating. And we were able to go back with our baby. So that was fun. And again, I liked putting in these um, tabs and um, fitting the journaling. Oops. This one as well. So this, this, this. And then, ta-da. And then this one, I pulled out my handheld sewing machine. And we have um, just a collage of pictures from around the house with grandparents and things that we would do during the day. Walk the dog, walk to the park. He had his first ride on the swing. Trying to get this back inside. With one hand was a bit ridiculous. And then uh, I have this one, which I created um, an acetate tag. 
for the page and some more pictures. I did the journaling on this side. So this was a cute um, little thing that I created. This was after the lessons were finished, but um, I used some of the techniques that I learned, which is cutting the pages. Um, and then this one is my last page. So for this one, I chose my favorite pictures from the airport, um, covering the, and the airplane. And I had lots of pictures as well. So I made this little mini album, just tucked away. Um, um, <laughs> let me see if my nails work to get this to tie out there we go and then so i just made this album with some accordion binding and uh, yeah documented to and for the airport on both sides and then some journaling and some tags from sun chasers so i really enjoyed using um the sun chaser collection for this last spread and of course using the fresher collection for most of the album as well as other items from my stash um and yeah i i like it i i will probably do a few more um albums that should have been stuck but I haven't done that yet. <laughs> a few more travel albums, maybe in the future. But I really enjoy this process. It's lots of fun. Just learning some new techniques. You know, I don't usually use um, travelers' notebooks, so or bound books like this. So that was interesting trying it. <laughs> um, and I like that. Yeah, it was just a uh, lot fun little project to help you know boost my creativity um i love trying new things all the time so that was also very fun for me and yeah so this is our trip for easter and that's it thanks so much for watching and i hope you enjoyed my little flip through see you soon bye